So hey guys, we're here from MHF Community, and I'm here with another with a new tutorial video for the, our new channel. Um, this time I'm here to show you how to get mods for Minecraft Pocket Edition. What you're gonna need is a jailbroken iPod. Um, you're gonna need to have Installus, and you're gonna need to have Cydia. Now, what you uh, you cannot do this with the App Store version of Minecraft Pocket Edition. You're gonna have to get Minecraft from Installus. So if you if you haven't already, if like you, if you're like me, if you purchased it for the App Store, you're gonna have to back up all your stuff and get rid of it. But go into install us, download Minecraft Pocket Edition, like usual, install it. Then what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to go into Cydia, and you gotta wait for Cydia to open. Have it take ages. You're going to need to add two sources here, and you're going to need to get something from each one of these sources. And... Mm. Alright, just cancel the update. Okay, so you're going to go to manage, uh, load up sources. And you're gonna need to add Cydia dot entire i n t y r e dot n l. Then once you're in here, you're gonna want to get this the the M C P E patch. Now that's gonna allow you to place mods into Minecraft Pocket Edition. But you're also gonna need to add another source that'll allow you to run them to keep the mods running. So you're gonna need to add Cydia dot my repo space dot com slash Cirrus. S I R I S. Then once you install that source, you're gonna to want to scroll down to L done. Now you're just gonna download that. It'll keep it'll it'll prevent Minecraft from crashing. Otherwise, if you don't get this, Minecraft will just crash with the app with the mods. Then once you're done with those, um, you can just exit uh, um, Cydia. Now once you have that installed, you'll get a new icon here that looks like this. So. This is the patcher itself. Um, L done doesn't actually show up with anything, but so it brings up these three menus. These are the mods that I have installed. Though the only one that gives you at the beginning is the firebug fix, and if you're an iOS user, you know what that is. And if you're not, it ran. If you have a fire blo if there's lava in your world at all, it could randomly place a fire block somewhere, and then it spreads through your entire world and burns everything. Um, but the, these are just a list of the mods right now. Um, I'll show you the rest of it in a bit, but we'll have to go into whatever you use to browse the internet. I'm going to go into Safari, even though I have Chrome, because my Safari is supposed to have the forum post open. So just give me a second, and I will link the, I'll link the forum in the description so you guys can look at this. But this is Entire's post on the Minecraft, po on the Minecraft forums about the patcher. Uh, once it loads up, so the the patcher you can only get iOS 4.3 and above. It has some translations, but according to some of the people in the forums, it's not very good translation. So if you don't speak English and you try to use the translations, I don't think it's gonna. It may look kind of sloppy, but once this takes an hour to load up. It should give us Entire's description of this. Uh, come on. Uh, okay, it's starting. It's going. Sorry for the fact that it's taking so slow, but this this site isn't very isn't very. Um, iPod worthy. It's not very powerful. Uh, the iPod, it's not very powerful to run the site because it requires a lot. But so here's Entire's post. All all of his information, all that stuff is here. But what we're going to want the, here are the mods listed at the bottom here. Here at the bottom you'll see mods and then a bunch of download links. What you're going to want to do is you're going to look at these and which when you find one that you want, a mod that you want, um, you're just going to want to copy the 
what's it uh the the link so here he's got um be able to break blocks instantly in creative no fog increased render distance TNT does 8x8, TNT does 16x16, TNT does 32x32, and TNT does 64x64. No fall damage, 2 slots, 3 slots, 4 slots, 5 slots, 6 slots, 7 slots, 8 slots, 9 slots, and 10 slots. So if you just want to, you just hold on one of the download links and hit copy. I'm going to just hit the, the creative damage and multiplayer. Um... So after you copy one, you're going to want to back out of whatever uh, works with me here. Come on. Okay, thank you. You're going to want to go into the MCPE patcher. <coughs> Once it loads up, you're going to want to go to downloads. Here, it'll bring up this. You just press on the little bit space here. You're going to want to hit paste. Then you just hit download and wait for it. There, new mod has been added to the list. So now creative damage multiplier, and you just click on it and hit apply patch. And give it a bit. And where it says normal at the bottom of it, it should change to patched. And that means it'll it's been applied. Just give it a bit. There we go. And switch to patch. And if you want to get want to get rid of the mod, like unapply it, then you just hit it again and hit apply patch. If you want to delete a mod, like usual, just slide, um, like any other iOS device. Now this third one here, I haven't figured out quite how to get the multiplayer to work. But what you do is you hit here, you name the server, whatever you want. Then here you put type in the uh, the 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 IP that's so that's applied hit add to list then once you hit um, once it's applied add to list you'd select it and then hit patch selected and it should pop up with um in your if you hit join game on Minecraft but for me it's not doing it and I don't know if it's just because the the servers are offline but that's how you get the that's how you get mods for Minecraft Pocket Edition um, I may just jump into it to show you the mods. Um, the orientation is going to look wrong, and the audio might crop out, so you you don't have to watch the rest of this, but um, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, if you have any comments or any questions, just let me know. Um, if anything goes wrong, just tell me, and I'll, I'll make sure you follow everything correctly. You Make, make sure you get L done, because without it, the mods will just cause Minecraft to crash. And... Thanks for watching guys, like, comment, subscribe, and now I'm just going to jump into Minecraft to show the, the mods and it might crap out and the orientation will look wrong. And if the audio does not crap out...